Hey everybody, we're at Overland Expo West. Uh, we're here showing the Van Ultra quick release mounts for rooftop tent. Uh, this is a product that we launched last year. We've been making several um, iterations for improvements. We've done about four or five small revisions. We, we get the feedback from our customers saying, hey, uh, you know, you can improve in this area, you can improve that. We would take that feedback seriously, so we integrate those changes into the design. Right now, we feel like we have a pretty mature product. Uh, we're happy to showcase it here. It's We have a blacked out version now. Previously, all of our parts were just raw stainless, and now we actually have them ED coated. It's like a, it's a paint that is uh, like dipped into a bath and then pulled back out. Um, after it's dipped, we actually go and laser engrave it. And that's how we can get this cool contrast color. We had a lot of feedback saying, I, I like the mounts, I just wish they were black. Because everything on my truck's black, I don't want silver mounts. So we took that feedback seriously and we're proud to show our new blacked out mounts. Let's talk about benefits. What's the benefit of buying a quick release system for your rooftop tent? The first one's pretty obvious, fuel mileage. Like with cost of fuel, most rooftop tent owners with something like this, this is a rectangular box. We know I've talked to a lot of Tacoma guys and they say we, we typically lose three to four miles per gallon if you have this up high above the cap. That's a lot of fuel mileage that you're missing out on. So with the quick release mounting system, you'll be able to remove that tent and get your fuel mileage back. Another feature is parking. There's a lot of parking structures, depending on how tall your rig is, that you may or may not be able to fit inside of a parking structure, especially in the downtown areas. If you work in downtown, you probably already know that you can't pull your rig into the parking lot, unless you re remove your rooftop tent. Now you can actually go and park in the parking garage instead of driving way around outside of the parking garage looking for a spot. Additionally, there's a lot of drive throughs out there. We have a Sprinter van. Our Sprinter van's eight and a half feet tall, right? Some of your guys' rigs are that same height. We're constantly looking through the drive through line to see if we can fit. You know, my wife loves Starbucks in the morning, so we'll try and go through. Not all Starbucks are created equal. Some of them have a lower, lower driveway, and we have to try and back up and make a U-turn because we're not gonna be able to fit through that drive through spot. So, if you have that rooftop tent, you can actually get to some of those drive throughs Removing your rooftop tent is your vehicle handling. The lower center of gravity, center of mass that a vehicle has, the better the handling is. This is proven in the race car world. Uh, that's why all the race cars that you see are super lowered to the ground, unlike everyone's lifted trucks. As soon as you have a rooftop tent up on there, you're driving around town, you're just doing some commuting, the whole truck's just gonna handle like a boat, just gonna be super uh, loosey-goosey. So, if you remove your rooftop tent, your truck's gonna handle way better, you'll get better fuel mileage, be able to get through the parking garages, and you'll just have a better truck. Another benefit of removing your rooftop tent is a utility. We've, we've talked to a lot of rooftop tent owners, and they're like, ah, I've kind of neutered my truck. I bought a truck to be able to haul whatever I want. I have motorcycles, I have mountain bikes, my, I have an old house and there's always stuff breaking. I have to go to Home Depot and go pick up stuff all the time. Well, if your rooftop tents off your truck, you have the utility to use your bed again. Isn't that like one of the reasons you bought your truck in the first place, right? To be able to put things in the bed. Well, if you have rooftop tent quick release mounts, you can actually pop your tent off. It's more of an incentivized to get that tent off and use your truck like the way it was designed to. So here's a set of mounts on a rooftop tent. This is a 23-0 walkabout tent. Uh, for the most part, our mounts are compatible with majority of the tents that are available on the market. Additionally, our mounts are compatible with majority of the racks that are on the market. So even if you end up changing your setup, going from tent to tent, or you decide to change out from a bed rack system to a canopy, something like that, um, our mounts can stay with you. They're an investment that you're gonna kind of carry, long, carry on. Most likely our mounts will actually last longer than your tent. Um, they're all made from stainless steel. Uh, nothing's gonna rust in there. They're all premium parts. Let me show you how they work. To open the mount, what we're gonna do is we're gonna twist this knob that's on the backside. This knob preloads the pin. Now that the pin's free, I'm gonna remove the clip and the clevis pin, then slide the mount open. Just like that, the mount's open. You do this four times and your tent's ready to come off. But the other thing you'll see is that these mounts are low profile. Instead of mounting on top of your crossbar, they're gonna mount below the crossbar. Um, a lot of the options that are out there on the market mount at the top of the intersection and we'll space the tent up. You know, some of the different mounts that are out there, typically an inch to inch and a half, sometimes two inches, to space your tent up. We didn't want to space your tent up, so we spent the time to figure out how are we gonna be able to keep your tent as low as possible, keep it low profile down to the roof of your vehicle. So we're gonna mount below the crossbar and keep it real low profile. Now, the other thing is the universal fit. Currently on the market, as the best as we know, there's no other quick release mount system that's gonna work with round tube. All the other quick release mounting systems require some sort of T-track 
for the system to work. And like I said, instead of mounting below, it's gonna mount at this intersection, so then you're gonna end up spacing your tent up. So if you have a, a rack with a round tube, we might be your only option. Now, another key feature of these mounts is the security aspect. We actually have a lot of customers that don't even care that much about the quick release system. They care, about, care more about protecting their investment. Some of these tents that uh, are on the market, you know, I think the new James Beru tent that just came out is upwards of five or six thousand dollars. That's a lot of money. So um, if you want to keep that tent locked on your vehicle and keep it from being removed, we have a solution for you. So the way the system works is instead of having a clevis pin in here, we have a hitch pin. Once that pin is installed, there's actually no access. Nobody can take this apart. And the reason being is that there's no exposed fasteners. You look at this part, there's no screws that can be removed. The only screws that are on this part are actually deep inside the bracketry. With the hardware up here, nobody can get any tools in there. So there's no way that you can actually take this apart. You can't steal it. We also get um, some questions about, okay, I see a knob. What's preventing someone from removing the knob and then opening up the tent? If someone decides to remove the knob, we could take this knob all the way off. Let's just, for example, back it all the way off. Okay, knob is off. If I try opening up this mount, you can see it stays. It's a little bit loose, and that's okay. We needed it loose to get the pin in and out. But no one can physically remove your tent from the rack. All they're gonna be able to do is steal your knob, and maybe take the tent and slide a little bit down your rack, but they won't be taking your tent off. So, that being said, we're probably the only mounting system out there that's really a true lock. And we're not a fan of padlocks. We don't wanna make rattling noises clacking around on your truck. So, we purposely designed it for a pin lock that makes no noise, no rattles. So here's the lock that we offer. It's all stainless steel. These locks are made in the US. They come with an O-ring seal and a dust cap. To remove this lock, you're gonna rotate the key and pull off the locking head. Once the knob's loose, that slides right out and then the mount opens up. So it's the same exact process with the lock or without the lock. There's a little bit extra step just by unthreading the key. One of the next features about these quick release mounts is that we have a sliding mount. The slides back and forth allows the tent to get off the rack. We actually have one mount that stays fixed to the tent at all times. The advantage of that is that your position of the tent is set every time. Because we have four of these corners staying in place, all you have to do is drop the tent onto the rack, and then slide it forward up until it butted up against the mounts. Then come in and slide the, close the sliding mount. After that, you're ready to go. Since the mounts stay with the tent, when you remove your tent, there's gonna be no bracketry stuck on your rack. You're not gonna have all these goofy brackets that always stay on your truck. As soon as the tent's off, you have a clean rack, that means you can mount your accessories, your kayaks, your surfboards, your bicycles. Our mounts are gonna be out of the way and you have a clean working surface. We have a lot of customers that have an Overland trailer and they say, hey guys, we move our tent from our trailer to our truck on a regular basis. It really depends on the trip. Long trailer, our long trip, we're gonna take the trailer. Short trip, we're taking the truck. That means they're gonna be moving the rooftop tent back and forth on a regular basis. So. What happens if, say, your trailer has round tube like this, but your truck has a standard crossbar? So the mounts are adjustable. When you take the pin out and slide the mount back, you can actually adjust the gross adjustment of the mount right here. So the same mounts will actually work with, say, a, a narrow crossbar and a wide crossbar. You can make that adjustment, come back in, and then now reclamp to a crossbar that's a different size. So if you wanna learn more, if you have some questions about how our system works, or if you have a setup that's not listed on our compatibility page, please reach out to us. Um, we have an email, it's called info at vanultra.com. We check it every day, we're always on there. We also have a phone number. On our website, it's listed, just give us a call. It's probably gonna be Anna and I to pick it up. We'd love to chat with you, learn about your setup, see what, so see what we can offer you.